So you're here in Germany. What's the importance of such an event? Uh, the importance is to bring together the potential investors or those who are already in business in Africa to meet with uh, African officials and more importantly the private sector in Africa. So uh, that's the, when I say, which I consider the most important thing. Obviously the meeting has to result uh, in, uh, say, potential or not agreements to work together in partnership mm -hmm. to do some development, some financing of a project in Africa. All right, um, let's talk about East, East Africa a bit in terms of um, small scale business and stuff. What do you think about the development there? Is it, is, it, is it on target or do we need a lot more help? Uh, in target, it's not contradictory to have more help. It's in target, but it has to be increased. We have to develop more uh, to give a different instrument to the small and medium scale entrepreneurs, to what is available, the kind of guarantee they can have uh, to access easily and greatly to uh, financing. Mm -hmm. So it's, uh, I would say it's, uh, it's on the right track. As a lady from uh, European Investment was saying, we have different scheme precisely in East Africa, uh, which we are developing. Uh, that is that is good. That's good. Of course, what is done there, as I was, uh, was my concern, or uh, my invitation to them, to replicate the same scheme in other part of uh, of the continent, you know, because uh, the medium scale uh, medium scale enterprises and uh, industry. Uh, we should be the backbone of uh, our develop industry, uh, economic development. Mm -hmm. It's happened that um, the about 30% uh, of SME in Africa are developed, are for, uh, led by African women. And if you consider that the 30% of the total SME, uh, SME are uh, held by 10% of women. So you can see the potential of increase. If we empower women in economic sense, they can have more uh, SMEs and uh, will be more participating in the development process. So we have these kind of meetings all the time, but are we getting the results of why we have these meetings? That is a very interesting question, because sometimes we do repeat what you can hear today, you may have heard it, or if you go through our books, uh, literature, it has all been said before. But what prevents a priest or uh, an imam to be saying the same truth, the same appeal to the people? It will reinforce their understanding of uh, uh, their belief. And for us, the belief here is that to reinforce by saying so, to invite more people, incremental step, in order to uh, achieve to our goal. Uh, but definitely, uh, sometimes uh, there is a bit of repetition, and you may say, uh, what is the purpose if there is no result? But I will say, Madam, uh, there is always a result, not as big as we wish it to be. But there is always a big, uh, some result. Two, three uh, uh, decades ago, when we are talking of Africa, the countries who, who can put as example of uh, good governance and uh, economic governance, political governance, we could only talk about Botswana and uh, Mauritius, you understand that that cannot make a, really uh, a big impact on the African development. But uh, today we can list at, uh, about six African countries out of the ten most, uh, 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 say, uh, mark uh, growth, uh, developmental growth, 
uh, Africa has six among ten in the world. It's the trend is going. The trend is reinforcing because we are doing reform because we have uh, the new generation who have, uh, who have really understood that we have to go to private sector. We have understood that the Africa will only be transformed, positively transformed, if they take uh, their own share in that process of transformation. We have this young generation who are, the, who are well educated, who have a uh, fantastic uh, networking through the world, through uh, uh, the media, the, I mean, uh, Facebook and others, they have connection uh, beyond the border and they, they are creative. And uh, so this new generation, we can say that Africa 2063, as AU is projecting, is going to be will have its right weight uh, to influence situations. Mm -hmm. The last question. Um, the, the, the purpose of this kind of, like this kind of meeting is to actually create linkages between African farms, SMEs, mm -hmm. that are starting with people who have money to help them you know, do their business. Okay. But I think, um, what do you think about the fact that the, the actual farmer who might actually need this help does not have the ability to be able to access this finance because they do not have the, the, the network or the contacts. No. The people who are attending this meeting, it's true, they are talking about developing agriculture, helping African farmers, etc. But they play a role of intermediation between the financial institution, the foreign financial institutions, and the farmers back home. So if they develop, they have this uh, uh, the system uh, put in place, and they come to, uh, to raise the awareness of the partners abroad to invest through them and through them to the African farmers. And the African farmers, they are organized at home. It's not going directly to a village to contact one person. No, they are organized at home. The line of credit will be given to the National uh, uh, Agricultural Bank and uh, 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 Cooperative, and then we will, we will, def we will benefit from that. So it's something very important uh, that we have this kind of meeting to really get this uh, intermediation of some institution from Africa together with the financial institution uh, international. We have one example which is quite interesting. The Director General of the National Development Bank of Brazil, he came to present what this international, this bank has done in Brazil in order to help the inclusion of the poor in the financial system, in order to finance uh, uh, energy sector and uh, rural development, etc. So the people, the, the African who are here, have listened to that and they know that the experience exists. And if they want to have a model, they can go and invite these people to come and work with them. And that will, uh, uh, I mean, the, that will help our African farmers, our Af uh, agricultural institution, and agricultural program to work together, to work uh, beautifully.